Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to WISRP, what's constant state road play? Right now I'm hiding in a garbage can. Some guy snitched at me, said I hit him on his bike, I never hit him on his bike, although he caught me off on the right side, so even if I did hit him, but he called the cops on me apparently, and there was cops at the burger shop, he snitched, so I hurried up and came home. I know that they're going to be looking for me, because obviously they know what those yellow cars are, and I heard the one cop as I was driving say, Wait, Mickey, is that you? So, I'm just fucking hiding, man. I don't know if I want to get out, man. Fuck. Hopefully the cops don't come. I know he was... He, I physically saw him talking to him, and the one cop tried to stab me, so... I'm afraid to get out. They know where I live. Fuck. Diggy's van's an impound. He might not be able to get it back because he's got no paperwork on it. They made me throw everything out. So I had to retitle it, everything. Porn magazines. All the bottles that he had that were pretty expensive. That were probably only a quarter or halfway drunk. He's going to be pissed about that. All, all the weed empty bags. I mean, there was no weed in there. But, I mean, he could have reused them, you know. Oh, shit. I'm hearing sirens. Just go away. They can't be looking for me, are they? Nah. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Nah, we should be good. Oh shit, I'm hearing sirens though. It's kind of... Kind of, kind of freaking me out. Shit. I think that guy in the bike's circling around. He doesn't know where I'm at. He might see my car. Let's get the cops out of here, man. Don't need them, man. I never hit the guy in the bike. I don't know what the fuck that guy was talking about. Oh, wait. Grabs AP gear. Uh oh. I think they're going to have a hard time trying to get in my house. But I'm not in there. They don't know where I'm at. Hopefully, they're dumb enough like they was when they're trying to look for a dicky. Fuck. I think I just need to get out of here. I hear someone walking around, man. Fuck.
I know they found my car. They just don't know where I'm at. <laughs> Fuck. This is like an intense like video. <laughs> Cause like I wasn't even gonna record. I hopped in. Ricky he's apparently uh one of the members of the server now and he's a cop again. And we were talking and then I was just driving around and apparently oh shit, is that a cop? But, but yeah, but then apparently, uh, like, after us talking, then apparently some biker, it was desync, but he was claiming it wasn't. Although he passed me on the right, so. I wasn't recording at the time, so it's not like I had any footage to share or give out, you know. I thought he was going to try to snitch on him, even though I don't really like to snitch on people, but. He claimed he hit me, he snitched, he told cops, and I started hiding. And this is what led to cops showing up at my house. After they showed up at my house, then I drove here, and I know they got to be on the other side. I'm gonna pop out, and I'm gonna see them. I, I'm just afraid to pop out because I know I'm gonna see them. Maybe I'm gonna try to go up these stairs. Back. Mm. I mean, I can't run. There's a priority in progress. Even if it goes away, I got a cooldown timer, so I, I, I'm not trying to run. I mean, technically, I, I didn't run in the first place. They never stopped me. It's just hard to tell if there's cops nearby or are those are locals. You know? It's hard to tell. I know as soon as I probably stand up, there's going to be a cop. But I'm gonna have to risk it for the biscuits, so. Because I know they had to see my car there. What's this? Act natural, act casually. I don't remember running too far. So yeah, I think they found it and they towed it. Fuck, I got no vehicle now. Fuck. I don't, re I don't remember parking it anywhere else. I thought it was over here. Fuck. Well, if I can make it to the hotels, I can try to go in Dickie's old room, and and because I know he's still got it kept up and being paid for, I might have to put some some hippie clothes on that he's got. I know I keep a spare change of clothes over there. Fuck. Gotta keep walking. They went ass. 
last last car I had was Dickie's van, at K5. Someone stole that like two, three months ago when I was locked up. I got out of jail and it was gone. It was missing, man. Hopefully I don't run into that biker either, man. You know he's gonna stop and be like, yo, what the fuck, man? Walking, man. Fuck is that punk ass fucking kid? Riding a fucking dirt bike around those fucking hit me. Piece of shit. Stop smoking cigarette right here. Yeah, right. Finish the cigarette. Let's get out of here. Just gotta make it to the hotel rooms, man. Get some change, some spare clothes on you now. Oh shit. Oh shit, I think it's that biker. Oh yeah, that was the biker. Can't let him see me. You know he's in the cause problems. Like, you fucking hit me, man. I didn't fucking hit him. I even told him that. Like, I didn't fucking hit you. Fuck off, dude. You almost fucking hit me again, you fucking punk. That's yeah, fucking kid. Let's cut through. Gotta make it to his room. Oh, shit. That wasn't a cop, was it? I'm not sure if that was a cop that went by. Kind of sketched out, man. Oh shit, yeah. That was cops. Just walk normal, man. Dickie's room is right over there, man. I, I know he's got some clothes in there. Let's run across the street. Let's get out of here. Fuck. Let's get let's go up here. Fuck. Yeah, he's just got the room on the other side over here. I know his credit card's still on fire with the Mona's money that we got back from when we, uh, I mean, when she, when she passed away, you know?
Yeah, I, I believe, yeah, yeah. Right here. What the fuck? Nah, no, this is this is his shirt, man. Ah, yeah, there we go. There's my hippie shirt. I'm gonna put his shirt on. No, I'm not wearing his fucking shirt. Alright, let's go. Oh shit, is that a cop? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Mickey. Hey, what's going on, man? Hi, man. Come. You... Where did that guy just go? Where did who go? There was another cop right here. He just was walking up in the booth. Alright. Maybe the Lord took him. Probably. Mickey, what's going on today, man? Yo, Mickey. I, I don't know what's going on, man. I'm, just, I'm trying to find Dickie. I don't believe you guys. He's not dead. I, I hate to tell you this, Mickey. No, but, no, don't, don't. Uh, I'm glad. I'm glad you're doing better compared to yesterday. Yeah, I mean, I still got, I still got the scars and stuff from the surgery. Well, I mean, you got shot about nine times. So yeah, I would imagine. I mean, I told you I was, I wasn't trying to do anything. I couldn't see, man. So, Mickey, what, what's up with? What's up with you going around punching people again and hitting people on their bikes? Hitting people on their bikes? No, I never hit anyone on their bike. The guy, he he passed on the right side and then he hit me and then he tried stopping in front of the burger shot trying to tell these other cops that I hit him. And I said, nah, that, nah, I, I left because that was BS, man. M Mickey, I, I, I was one of those cops, dog. I watched it happen. Yeah, well, he passed on the yeah, right side. Yeah, you see, if you would have just stayed and talked to me... I probably would have found him at fault, but see, now it's a hit and run. Oh, come on, man. Mickey, you, you know I gotta take you in, right? Nah, come on, please, don't take me in. And also, we're getting calls that that you're punching people. What's all that about? Punching people? I never punched anyone today. Right, so if I, so if I go back to that bar and ask... You can go back. I, all I did is went upstairs and I, I, I left. Hit in a dumpster? No, I don't hide him. That's gross. Mickey, I've already been to your house. I mean, that's where Dick. I mean, that's where Dickie was hiding the day you guys were looking for him, and you guys went in the house, and he he was hiding in his. Well, actually, he was in his truck the whole time. Mickey, you were in the dumpster because when me and my sergeant over here went up into your house, you <laughs> hopped in here. What the? See, you should be more worried about that. I ain't doing anything wrong. I'm Anyways. You, you were in the dumpster because when me and my sergeant went up to go talk to you, you hopped in your jeep and ran away. No, I didn't run away. Your, your jeep's impounded, by the way. My jeep? I mean, I was driving yeah. Dickie's van. I can't find no, it anymore. You were you were in your jeep with the license plate of Mickey. Allegedly. How else do you think I knew? It? No, it wasn't allegedly. I saw you. <laughs> I. I mean, you got two eyes at I mean, come on, man. I didn't do anything though. Mickey. I really didn't, man. He's the one that passed on the right. I wasn't going to stay for that BS because it was BS. It's still hitting on, Mickey. So, I mean, he refused to give me go, his go insurance. Back, go back to the bar. Ask him if Mickey assaulted anybody. Come on, you don't got to do that. No, no, stay here, man. Come on, man. I'm just trying to have a good day looking for my brother, man. I, I get that, Mickey, but... You gotta understand that, that A, Dickie's dead. Allegedly. I don't I believe it. Him. I, I, I shot him about 12 times in the goddamn face. I know I know. my cousin Ricky's dead. Dickie's... Ricky, Ricky's alive. He's I just a, saw him the other day. He's alive. And he should be yeah. dead. He got shot. And I got condoled by, uh, I think it's O3's wife. She was hugging me and telling me that she's sorry that this had to happen. Hey, Williams, can you go to that hall on the radio? Unless we got other people. The 911. That's only Slade is there.
Or 702 all units. Make sure if you're responding to 911, you advise so you don't have 20 people responding to a simple call. So, Mickey, you realize if my sergeant tells me that he hit someone, we're going to have a different, different conversation, right? Well, why, man? I didn't hit anyone. I'm telling you the truth, man. All right. The only I'm person that I allegedly hit was that biker, but he passed on the right. I, I watched you hit him, Mickey. Yeah, and you then I hit each other at the then same he came time. To, then, he, then he came to my window. I said, I want his assurance, and he told me, no, he ain't going to give me anything. He's going to snitch on me. I said, I want your insurance, and he told me, no, he walked away. So I said, you know what, whatever, because technically, physically, in my eyes, that didn't happen. That's why I just wanted to get his insurance number, but he didn't want to do anything about it. All right, no, what he was doing was he was coming over to me and asking me for my insurance. I'm well, not asking me for my insurance, asking me to handle the situation. Yeah, well, he just could have gave me his insurance, and then I would have given him mine, it would have been done, but he told me no. And then he showed back up at the bar when I was trying to go home, and he was causing problems there, and the bartender told him to have to leave, because he doesn't live upstairs, I live upstairs. And he told her to F off, and then I just went upstairs, man, and then apparently you guys came, and then I just, I was just getting scared again, man. Wait, it's no offense, Mickey. I'm really, I'm really tired of seeing you. I mean, I, I mean, I, I don't want to see you guys unless it's in good circumstances, but this is bad circumstances. I didn't do anything, man. You're good, Williams. Yeah. It was that biker guy caused that he could just give me his information and we all could have went from there. But then he said no, he wasn't giving it to me. Then he said he's going to go snitch, but he's the one that cut me off. And I said, whatever, I'm just not dealing with this. Because technically my K5 that I was driving, I there was no scratches. In, I never hit him. And he allegedly uh -huh. said I hit him. So you were in the K5. Yeah, I'll admit that I was in the K5, man. Why'd you hide in a dumpster and run away from me? I got scared, man, because he said he was calling the cops, and then he showed up at the bar, and he was causing more problems, Then the local bartender told him to leave, and I told him he's not allowed to come to my house, so he said he's going to break the door down, he said that I hit him off his bike, he said that he wants me to go to jail, and I said, well, you didn't give me your insurance number, he said, I don't have to give that to you, that's for the cops to discuss, I'm like, why, when you get in an accident, you're supposed to give your insurance number to the person, and then that things could be settled better that way, instead of getting cops involved, and he didn't want to listen, man. Yeah, I mean, I told him allegedly. I, I I physically didn't hit him. He said I did, but I told him not, not in my eyes. I got why you got you blicky out there, Christy? Damn. Well, damn. You, you can put that up, yeah, Greasy. I'm not yeah, gonna no, do I anything. Didn't, I didn't mean to pull it out. I I, I, pull I don't out. got that bottle anymore, man. Send it. Okay. Oh, that guy got real fucking close to Hey, Mickey, gotta oh, check no, he, he, Yeah, man. We have people fucking shooting. Oh, my God. I'm going behind this wall real quick. Gotta love him, man. Gotta fucking love him. Adam four to seven two. Uh, come back over here real quick. It's crazy, man. Guy, guy was shooting. Is that fucking dude that G? By the way, that one right there. Yeah. Technically, the guy at an RP, he never showed back up. But I'm gonna try to RP that he did. I don't want to go to jail because allegedly, yeah. You having a good day, uh, Mickey? 
Yeah, I mean, my day's been alright. Just been, I mean, as I say, I don't want to believe that Dickie's dead, so I've been looking for him. But then that biker guy tried saying that I hit him, and I said, not in my eyes. And then he wouldn't give me his insurance information. Then he said he's going to snitch. And then I just, I couldn't handle it. So I just, I just went home, man. I got a question for you, Mickey. Who's this Vicky person I've been hearing about? Vicky? Yeah. Nah, I don't know no Vicky. I know Dicky, my brother, Ricky, my cousin. I mean, I know there's a girl named Becky that works at the bar downstairs from my house. She doesn't like Dicky because, well, that one time you guys are looking for him, he spit on her. And then, uh, then the other bar, the Yellow Jack, that's uh, Sandra that works there. She kind of likes us, but not really. But she wants our business due to this other bar being open, and she doesn't want to go to business. Well, I was talking to Ricky, so and he was mentioning some some Vicky person or something like maybe that. he's dating someone named Vicky I don't know yeah I don't know maybe I haven't talked to him in a while because I mean technically he, the cops told me well the o three's wife told me when I was on scene and in cuffs and whatnot and they were attending to me that he was dead well come to find out Ricky Ricky's alive no oh. I talked to him earlier today I mean that's good I mean I've been trying to call him he's not answering his phone yeah, I don't know. Maybe he's just trying to lay low or something. Maybe, maybe. He, uh, uh, then again, usually when Ricky lays low or Dicky lays low, they got a warrant out for their arrest. That's the only time yeah, they lay low. Your friend with the bar sip. He didn't assault anybody down there. Um, just that bike guy came in and stated that he hit him off his bike, but he later left. Yeah, he came in and said I hit him off his bike, and then he started... He didn't hit him off of his bike, because I witnessed that ordeal. Well, that's what he told the bartender. I said well, that was a lie. Since this is turning into a big he said, she said, Mickey, just keep your distance from that bike guy. Alrighty, man. And try to stop getting into shit, because I'm really tired of seeing you in this way. I mean, I'm... I much rather see you under hey, good circumstances. Nice Mickey, man. He's I'd, I'd much rather see him under good circumstances than bad circumstances. I mean, normally I'd be in jail right now. You'd either be pulling me over because I got drugs in the van, which I'm not doing any drugs anymore. I'm trying to clean myself. Or I'd try to be killing a cop. Or, I, have I done that lately? No, because I'm trying to change my life around, man. Good, I'm proud of you. Keep changing. That's what I I'm trying to do. I God I seen Dickie's van. Were you driving Dickie's van earlier? I sure wasn't. I was driving the K5 all day. You seen his van That's driving around? Got it. Yeah, I seen his van driving around, and they're blowing fat fucking clouds out of the damn driver window. See, I told you he's not dead. He's still alive, man. I'll believe it when I see it. No, I'm going to find him, and I'm going to prove to you guys that he's still here. I'll Actually, you know, I'd love to hear. I, I Honestly, take a picture. Take a video. Oh yeah, if I see him, I'm gonna pull my phone out and be like, yeah, yeah, Greasy said that that you're n World you're not stolen. alive, and then I'm gonna be like, oh yeah, watch this. I'm gonna flip the camera and be like, say what's up, to Greasy, and he's gonna say hi to you. Then I'm gonna come to the police station. I'm gonna request for you to come down and show you the video. He's not dead, man. I don't believe you guys. Damn. That didn't take Damn. long. Shit. Of all people to do it. Uh huh. Well, shit. <laughs> alright, Mickey, oh you get out of here. You have yourself a better night, alright? Alrighty, man. Uh, of all people to do that. Yeah, I'm gonna go figure that one out. Shit, nah. I don't got a fucking car. Fucking impound it. Fuck, what am I gonna do, man? Yeah. Mickey, no, I never. Can, Mickey, can, I never did the log. Can, 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 so technically, it's not impounded. Can you give me a ride back to my house? Yeah, sure. You got him, Grayson. Yep. I appreciate right, it, man. You can ride shotgun, man. Ah, oh, thanks, man. Have a good night, guys. Hey, you too. I appreciate this ride, man. Yeah, no problem. Just go ahead and uh. uh I got Apple CarPlay. Just go ahead and put in the postal on the in the CarPlay. All right, man. All righty, there you go. You don't mind if I put on the radio, right? 
No, go for it, man. Yeah, I'm gonna listen to some Pop Smoke, man. That's Ricky's favorite artist. <laughs> Just playing a Pop Smoke and Racy Scar. <laughs> nah, thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. Alright, have a good one. Hey, you take care, Mickey. You too, man. Fucking pig. Come on, Becky. You know what you did. Come on. Yeah, back here. You know what you did. It's not working. Yeah, the garage door. It's not working. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Now, come on. Come on. This way. No, quit struggling. Quit struggling. Quit struggling. Get in there. Get in there. Yep. She's all tied up. Put tape on her mouth. Snitch on me. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Do you have it? I got hassled by some biker guy. Went around looking for a dickie again. Um, and the cops are still saying he's dead. I didn't want to believe that, man. But, yeah. Just a little throwaway video that I'm putting out to have some more of Mickey trying to look for Dickie type deal, you know, so, yeah, um, they claim that he's dead, I'm not believing that, but other than that, ladies and gentlemen, this is where I'm going to end it, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, uh, we'll see what this video withholds and comes out to be, after there's editing and you guys are seeing it, so, I hope you guys liked it, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, as I said, and I will see you guys next time, thanks for watching. Later.